Hey y'all, what's up? I got rid of my bow. You know what I'm saying? Because just people were staring at me today. Must have been the shirt. You know. They must think I'm in denial because I guess I don't make this shirt look good, but whatever. Anyways. <laughs> I am in some kind of mood. I don't know why. <laughs> I <laughs> I don't know why, y'all. I only had a I only had a Pepsi Cherry soda. And then I had some water. So I don't know. Okay. So, I have a Dollar Tree haul. So, let's just get into it and shut up, Kim. Okay. Now, I got some things. Some things, okay? And I don't know whether I can show them. Well, you know what? Just shut up, Kim. Just show them. Okay. So, uh, I liked this pillow. I, I just don't know why. I think um, Creative Chica, Miss Tony, she, she hauled the bins. And I got to looking at the bins. And I thought, you know what? I'm like pillows there there are things that just make me happy and these colors and the little poofy balls the little pom-poms on them you know it just made me happy now this is gonna go this is just like ridiculous as heck you know the tag is about as bigger than the daggone pillow but um so yeah I got I got me one of the pillows they did not have these when I went in the store you know what I'm saying they did not and I got all three of them I got all three of these not for you know what it says um, I think my friend picked me up one but I I want these because I want to change them out and put another um, you know I want to use them for like the glitter of course my neighbor's gonna stand there and weird me out this one says life is my favorite adventure so I'm gonna take now like if, if somebody sends me one um, you know, I'm not going to DIY it. I'm going to DIY these ones that I get. But um, I wanted to, you know, DIY and put something in. So that's what that one says. This one says walking on sunshine. You know, I should have got two of these. Because my family member who passed, he always he always used to sing. Not always, but, you know, when he got in like a little, you know, goofy mood, he would, um, what would he say? He would sing You Are My Sunshine. So this one, walking on sunshine because it has the word. But anyway, and then Imagine, Dream, and Believe, like I said, I just picked up all three colors so that way I could make, you know, my own frame kind of things. Okay, so I got me some of these. I ran out of mine. They're the Haribo Gummy Bears in the Sour. You know, look at this, y'all. Does this look like, okay, I mean, I think that they're downsizing on size, or is it just me? Because I would think that you would get at least got up to here. And now the little suckers, I mean, they're not melted. I mean, so I don't know. That's just crazy. But probably they are. Okay. My friend knows that I got her these because I told her. Because I didn't want her, you know, to buy them. And then I'm going to send them unless she wants double. She can do what, what she wants. I, I haven't tried them yet because Eric just now fixed my phone like five minutes ago. But I picked her up. And these are almost gone at my store. I think there's probably one more set left. Um, the LA Colors Body Mist and the Berry. And I got her the LA Colors Body Mist and the Pineapple. And the other two are not in this bag. So I hope they're in here. Okay, then I found, I so, so wanted these. And I so, so was so excited that they were in here. I got, I found the big markers. And they're called, these are called Twixie 2-in-1. And it looks like there's an ice cream scent, a lemon, a lime, and an orange because it's on the back. So, yeah. And it says chisel tip. Now my neighbor's looking at me, and I don't know her. Okay, then I found, this is four, really, Kim? This is four bright, bold colors and scents. And yeah, this is by Twixie, too. Can you guys see those? And I don't know what the hay. I don't know what this one, unless it's like all kinds of fruit. It looks like blueberry pie and cupcake, and I don't know what the one is up there. And then this one is like Mamba Jamba. Mamba Jambo. I guess that's licorice and cupcake or something. So, no clue. Alrighty. I'm already like needing to put my, it probably would be worse with my hair because I think I'm going to let my hair grow. I should just shave it off. 
and get a and get a tattoo, like a spiritual tattoo. Okay. Um, I don't know what I've showed you. Hold on, guys. Work work with me here. Let's see. I showed you that one. Okay, so I don't need to show you any more of these, I don't think. Because, okay, I don't think I've showed you this one. So this is the Twixie. This is called the Super Tip. And you get all those colors. And then here are all the, I guess, scents. I was going to say flavors. They're not Food Chem. So that's all that you get in there. Okay. Now I've got to dig in this bag. Okay, here's the other one. And... Because basically what I have in here that I can't show you is a friend mail. Oh, dear heavens. Okay, here it is. I'm going to put these. Okay, bye, neighbor, whoever you were. Uh, this is the strawberry spritz one. And then this one is the peach refresher. I haven't even tried these yet because I wanted to do it on, on the film. I was going to say. And I had, it was so funny because I, um, I had my eye appointment today and I found out that... Um, Another YouTuber had her eyes done too. I thought that was really cool. Okay, not gonna show everybody's biz on, on YouTube, but it just made me laugh. Okay, I've really, not a lot of items. See, I can't show you. This is going to my friends. <laughs> I call everybody my friend. Like I told my other friends who I just, you know, well, kind of, kind of maybe just met um, on, on YouTube and on Facebook that um you know if you make me feel like if I feel like if we share a laugh or they make me smile you know they go into my friend category you know what I'm saying it is what it is I mean good lord don't tell me there's some kind of thing okay now I bought 10 of these I cleared the box because I, I already have some of these I have like seven maybe eight nine I don't know okay Bo, don't fall off the thing okay but I I was feeling like I was mad at Eric because Eric's not the type that's like, whoa, we're going to the Dollar Tree. You know, he's a typical male, like, okay, I'll drive you to the Dollar Tree. I told him, stay in the car. I'm going in my happy place. You stay in the car, you know, but no, he had to come in and have his little attitude. I always grab, a, grab one of those kid baseball bats and put it in the car. And if I see the nunchucks, I put them in the car and a fly swatter. And I put them in the cart, not the car, the cart. And... And Eric will, and Eric will like take them out because he knows what they're for. <laughs> okay. Anyway, so I got 10 of these. You need some entertainment to go along with the Dollar Tree haul, right? I got 10 of these cotton stems. You all should see my one cotton stems. I have this big, um, ceramic boot and it has, it's white and it's got, I think it's got flowers, like daisy flowers on it or something. Like they've got four petals and they're different colors. And I have some, um, what are those flowers that the Dollar Tree sold? No, not Gerber daisies. Like big daisies, I think. Maybe they are Gerber daisies, I don't know. But they were big. I got some at Michael's though for, you know, way back. Well, anyway, my poor cotton stems. And then the air conditioner is like, you know, right here. And then the boot is like right here. And the poor cotton stems look like this. <laughs> They are all drooping like the damn things are real and they need some water. I'm like, oh my gosh. <laughs> I don't know what happened. But anyway, so I got 10. Don't believe me? Hold on. I, I, I was only going to get 7 because seven, 7 is, is my uh, lucky number. You might need that one day for a quiz, so remember that. And, um, but... <laughs> I cleared them. I, I, saw, I thought, you know, I looked at the three more and I thought, you know, Kim, somebody could use those. But because I was depressed when I went in there, I said, the heck with that other person. I'm buying them all. So I don't know what the heck I'm going to do with them. So I did, I did see somebody make a wreath and I thought that was really pretty. So I might try to make a wreath. I don't know how the heck they made it using these things, but, or, you know, centerpieces or whatever, but I don't know how the heck I'm getting these back in the bag. And you know what? Really quick, y'all. Look, I just threw them down. They're going to get all dirty. I have a target. So I'm just going to throw the target in. How many minutes am I? Okay, that's not bad. I really don't give a poop. But anyways, so I got this mail order. Now, granted, I went into Target first. Then I went into, and Loretta McCobb, if you're watching my thing, 
um, comment down below or Instagram me or something um, those Shopkins. Do you have the package of what they look like or um, oh, let me think. The, the package or um, the name of them or where you got them. The toy section. They told us they were in some bin. Eric went around the store and I got, I'm walking around in Target and the Dollar Tree with my eyes dilated and I mean it was a hot mess. So luckily I didn't run into nobody or into, well I did run into um, well the cart you know because the there was a silver thing in the kids section because I was looking for those cool planners and stuff like that. They, but my, my target sucks. Anyway, they don't know how to stock. The kids section is bare. You know, the it's like bare. I'm like, I hope it doesn't look like this at Christmas because them kids going to cry. But anyway, so I got this mailer and I like that it's like, you know, it's not the paper one like the Dollar Tree. So, you know, it can take like a beating. So I'll mail my friend's package off tomorrow. Lord help me. That's been bugging the heck out of me. And okay, I'm going to save that for last because there's a story. And then I had no idea. Oh, look at that. Now I can see. I didn't even know what these looked like, but I grabbed myself these because I like the cat in the hat. And these were in the kids section. Oh, I think this was like 79 cents or 80 some cents. I have no idea because I couldn't see. And then I grabbed this one. I thought, well, I like, you know, I like what I could see at a distance, you know, all the colors and stuff. So... I just went ahead and got it and then you know it's got a pretty decent amount it'll probably just sit in my stash and never be used and then maybe winter time I can craft and use stuff I almost thought this looked like Spongebob for a minute there I guess my eyes aren't truly ready yet now it looks like one of the Flintstones houses okay and then oh okay there it is I wanted to get my friend one of these to put in her package but I kind of forgot so if I go back Oh, oh lord my neighbor's out again um so this is an eraser I don't know why she gotta stand up on the damn step it looks like an artichoke or something like the insides of something that's kind of weird they don't smell but these are erasers if I didn't say this is a green one they look like logs yes please sit down so I don't have to look at you thank you good listening give you a cookie Okay, and then this one is just yellow, and it has the lemon. Okay, um, so, yeah, you guys would have laughed at me because I'm, like, taking, I have to take off my glasses. I'm getting, I just went, I'm getting, finally, it's been, y'all would not believe this. We are in the year of 2019. Their computer says that I have not been there since 2016. I have stigmatisms apparently in, in my eyeballs or something is something about my eyes are shaped like a football whatever the heck that means and um, I guess it's both of them and so I think you're supposed to go when you have stigmatisms I don't know <laughs> if you go like every two years I was supposed to go every two years but then when they oh you have stigmatisms it's like I guess they wanted me to come back in a year I don't know but anyway I lost my glasses like these ones um and so anyway, so I'm getting, I got my, I got a spare pair in case I, gosh forbid, you know, I messed up these ones. Um, but both, th then these are going to be sent, so I'm going to have another pair, you know, be wearing another pair of glasses. That's going to be a hot mess because, you know, the bifocals are going to be down here. That's what happens when you, when you're in your 40s, you need bifocals. Yeah. Okay. Anyway, so I was trying to read, you know, this because I, I kept asking Eric, I'm like, Eric, what is this? What is that? because I really couldn't see. Well, this, I didn't know what the heck it was, you know? I was like, what is this? So I finally had to take off my glasses and then I, you know, right up to my face and I was like, oh, that's an eraser. Okay, so the one thing I wanted, I wanted the Shopkins. I could not find them. They are so cute. Oh my gosh, you guys have to go check out Loretta Macabre. I don't know if it's Macabre or Macabre, but go check out her YouTube channel. She is freaking amazing. She does, um, I don't know how... I don't know how I want to word it, but she, oh, how do you, I don't know. Let me think. She does amazing things with her Barbies. You know, she does like displays. They have fashion shows and shopping and, and what they bought and what she got. And she's got hauls, you know, Dollar Tree, Target, Thrift, Goodwill. I think she's done a Goodwill one. But, you know, thrift, because um, we all have different thrift stores. We might not all have the same. 
Um, but I just, I mean, she brings them Barbies to life. I swear, she makes me want to go upstairs and apologize profusely to my Barbies. I'm not even kidding you guys, you know, because my Barbies are probably just laying up in the attic, you know, getting sun dried and they're probably overly tanned or what, whatever. Um, and, but she had showed these Shopkins that are so beyond cute. If mine had them, they probably sold out. But, um, so, but I went to Target and I was looking for the Shopkins and I was looking for this item. I, I knew this item because I watched a haul and they said that this item was in, I forgot who it was that I hauled. They're not sub to me. Lord, she's staring at me again. Um, it's, uh, a little something, but I don't remember her whole, she, she's going to get on my nerves. She's a counselor. Basically this house that's next to us is a, um, is a house for men like they had my my uh my neighbor he proposed to me he had down syndrome his name was kevin i love him god rest his soul and francis i don't know what francis had but francis was tall and he was crazy and every time his watch needed to be fixed he came down the stairs you could hear him don't 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 you know coming down the steps and he'd be like fix it fix it fix it and i'm like I'm like, dude, I can't fix your arm. Not me, you know, not knowing he had a watch in this hand and he's going, you know, like this to his arm. And I'm like, dude, I ain't no doctor. I can't fix your arm. <laughs> um, but anyway, they're all gone. They're all, they all passed away. Um, and even John, I didn't even know that John, um, John always called me bad girl and he made me want to go out and, you know, create some kind of sin or something. But anyway, so there are counselors over there and the counselor keeps coming out and I don't know why she got to look at me in the car, but I guess who else sits in an air conditioned car you know, <laughs> and talks to their self. So I guess that's why she's like, mm -hmm, she's going to be coming over here living with us. But anyway, so about this, I'm going to try to hurry up. Um, you got to see I'm at least a little bit entertaining um, in rare form for sure. But when we, I was frustrated because everybody in there, everybody in my state, my city, hell, my state was in Target, okay? The parking lot was like stinking, must have been at Christmas. You know what I'm saying? Like there was hardly no parking. We drove around a couple times, you know, and where I really wanted Eric to park, he didn't park. So, okay, it was loaded with people, put it that way. Okay, well, I'm trying to look in the, um, I'm trying to look in the dollar spot. My eyes are daggone dilated. I really can't see. I got my sunglasses on, you know, with my glasses and, this woman is trying to come at me with her daggone shopping car, and you know how I feel about personal space. If you're not family, get the heck away from me. Okay, if I stretch your arms and I can touch you, we got an issue. You know what I'm saying? <sighs> just because I'm fat and bouncy doesn't mean that you can just come over and, and feel it, you know? Gee. Okay. So, I'm trying my dangdest to look at the, at, you know, look at this stuff. And I could not tell you really unless i put it up to my face what the heck it was i'm pretty sure everybody's had their eyes dilated okay well dummy me's trying to shop while i got eyes dilated because i figured my eyes were getting better and she didn't dilate me till the end of the thing and i'm i'm thinking well don't i need my eyes dilated you know like before you're like looking at them in the machine and all that mess but she did it like afterwards and then had me look up and down left and right and then i was done so i don't know <sighs> maybe maybe i need a new, i don't know maybe i need a new doctor <laughs> Anyways, so I'm looking for what I'm about to show you, and they did not have it, and I was really, really disappointed, and I thought, okay, they're going to have these Shopkins. No, they didn't have the Shopkins either. Well, before the Shopkins, I'm looking in the dishware section, okay, and I found this shaped container in the container section. Eric went to go price it. I think it was like $10, not this one, but the other one. And, but then I walked all the way down the aisle, you know, that we were in, you know, the little aisle of, um, you know, containers and stuff. And on the end cap, there's these, um, my family member, she's going to come out here and think I'm nuts. That, that, um, on the end cap, there was these coffee pots Well, sitting right in between. I don't know if somebody was trying to hide this or not. But somebody must have sat it there because here it is. Can you guys see? It says, um, what does it say? Oh, gosh. Never, never, never settle for just one scoop. 
Now, I, I don't really need this, but this is adorable. The reason I wanted this, though, is because this one was only $5. The other one would have been like... And then there was a daggone price that said, I mean, on my ticket... Okay, I don't have my ticket. It's in the house. I'm in the car. Um, on the ticket, it said something like, buy one, get one free. And I'm like, what? So like 71 cents or whatever was taken off of this. I'm thinking that's dumb. They should have just gave it to me for half price if that's what it was. Because if I could have found another one, hell, I would have got another one, but I couldn't find another one. So anyways, if I, if I come across it again and if it says buy one, get one, or, or if I, you know, if I find out, then I might return this one or be like, hey, you know, can I repurchase this, you know, this one and buy this one? I don't know. Something because my ticket says this. So we shall see. I don't know. But I got this. Y'all are going to laugh at me. Um, I don't know what my problem, you know, what my issue is, but I'm always, I'm always afraid that I'm not going to be able to be here, you know, forever, like live here until I die basically. And sometimes when I'm out in the garden, I will find really cool rocks and stuff. And so basically, you know, I want to keep them because I think they're really cool. They're just rocks, but I wanted something to put them in. And so I thought about this container that I could just take this off. So, you know, gently put my rocks in here and I can look at them. You know, they're not like in something. Um, but I was really excited, you know, to see this. So, anyway, that's my, that's it, guys. I didn't know I was going to talk long or, you know, whatever. But you never know with me. I haven't done a video in a while. So, and I'm not going to delete this one. Those are my erasers. So, that is it. That is it. I'm going to shove these in here. I really don't know how I'm going to send my friends, um, you know, miss to her because I don't want it. I mean, they're going to go and I need to take my bow with me. Put my bow here somewhere. A neighbor comes out here again. I'm going to scream. I guess if she comes out on the steps, she might ask me something. I don't know. But um, anyways, guys, it was a nice day. Eric did have off today for Tuesday, so that was nice. But um. I guess I'm going to go because, I, like I said, I showed you everything that I that I got. I hope the markers work out because I got some off of Etsy from my favorite seller. And it's not her. It's not their fault. Um, you know, but I don't know. They're supposed to have some kind of sparkle or whatever. And they just weren't. Some of them were, like, dry. Like, the, the silver grayish one. I couldn't even see it on the paper. And I'm like, wow. I'm like, where's the ink? And then I thought, okay, maybe I need to shake it. Maybe I need to push it down. But it wasn't one of those because it didn't have like the, you know, the the spring or whatever, you know, that you push down and, you know, it pops back up. So I'm like, whatever. So I tried and I just told her, you know, because I was going to leave like a, you know, I wasn't really happy. So I was going to, you know, put like three stars or whatever. And of course, when you do that, holy heck, Eric's back. <laughs> Eric's looking at me like, seriously? Yeah. <laughs> but, um, so then, you know, they were like, well, you know, we'll refund your money. And I'm like, well, you know, you don't really have to. I mean, some of the markers work. So, I mean, they could have just, you know, either refunded one or none. You know, it didn't matter to me. I just wanted to let them know that, you know, because it seems like you can't leave a bad remark. So, I'm like, whatever. I mean, you know, bad, bad rating, you know, with the stars. So, all right, guys. Eric has dinner. So, I'm going to go in and have dinner. I hope you guys had a blessed Tuesday. And, um, you know, thanks for like, liking, commenting, and subscribing. And, um, if I missed your guys' comments, I'm sorry. I don't mean to. I'm, I try to, um, catch up. But sometimes if I'm in a funk or depression or anxiety or whatever, I don't, I see them and I try to hit the heart. I don't know what's going on with the heart. And I don't know what's going on with subbing because there was a gal that I was sub to and then I went to watch her, her, um, I don't know who the heck Eric's waving to. Um, hold on guys. Oh, it's just my family member. So, um, but anyway, um, so yeah, I found out that I was unscribed to her and I'm like, what the heck? I'm like, no wonder she wasn't coming up in my thing. So I had to sub back, but then I didn't, you know, I don't know if you, it does, does, um, Oh, I should just make a whole nother video. Anyway, guys, you just have to watch this in two or three parts. Um, does YouTube have a messenger? I thought they took it off.
but I, I don't have any way to get on it, you know, because like I said, I don't have a laptop. I really need to get that. My cousin has white hair. He's really getting old. Ugh, looks like an old fart. But anyway, um, my cousin lives over in that house that I was telling you guys. His mama died, so he moved over there. My great aunt. But anyway, so yeah, and like when I think when I think that I've hit the heart, and I go back when I finally you know I hit the hearts, you know I read it and then I hit the heart, and then I you know I jump off or whatever, and then I go back and it's like one of the hearts might not be lit, and I'm like wait a minute I done hit everybody's heart, not like um you know like somebody's you know better. Oh my gosh, it's like spazzing me out. I'm like, dude. Anyway, y'all have a great one. Thanks for everything. I hope you enjoyed what you've seen. If not, leave me a comment. <laughs> oh yeah, and if you go to like pick me out to, to delete me or like unsub, could you like come over on Facebook or, or send me a message or Instagram me and be like, hey Kim, this is why I can't have you, you know, on my subscription anymore. Because one gal that you know was like really friendly to me she like I'm not on her thing anymore and I'm just like wow it was a slap in the face because I thought she was on my page and I'm like I don't know but you know I am me I, I really try not you know not to cuss I mean there are more bad things you can do I don't drink or smoke and I don't do drugs you know I might spit out a word every now and then but anyways whatever I'm also fat, so I guess that's illegal as well. But who knows? I don't know. But, you know, it would be nice. I don't really delete. I mean, I don't really, um, you know, unsub to people. I did unsub to this one woman because she was showing, she was doing the video in the dark. And then she was a mile away from her stuff and I couldn't see. So, I was like, whatever. Every video was the same. But, unless, unless it's like content that I really can't stand or people are, you know, being, you know, really, really, I don't know, whatever. It has to be a lot for me to unsub, put it that way. But anyway, y'all, whatever, just me and my, you know, YouTube, because nobody thinks about that, just me. <laughs> but anyways, I will talk to you guys later, just me being real. <sighs> Always real. Eric had a 50% off at Outback, so that's 50% off everything, so... Yes. So, wonderful. I'm craving ice cream. Does anybody have ice cream before dinner? Anyways, y'all, I'm going to go. Sorry I didn't make them be this long, but I just feel like it's been forever since I did a video or was able to, because I've been deleting all my videos again. So, I'm not going to delete this one. I really didn't say anything that I think, oh my gosh, people are going to want to leave my channel. I guess I'm too hot to handle, so. Anyways. <laughs> anyway, y'all, I will talk to you later before I go insane. Okay, bye.